It's Chris with Allaire Homes. Something you've probably come across is air tightness. What does air tightness mean in relation to your custom home build? And so to help you understand that, we need to get into building science a little bit. So air tightness is really the practice of controlling air that enters and leaves your home. In the past, homes were quite leaky and there was a lot of air that moved through the wall system. And that really didn't matter because there wasn't a lot of insulation. So that air would dry because of the inside warm air leaving and so the moisture wasn't a problem. As energy costs increased, regulations required more and more insulation. And what ended up happening is that the moisture that came into that highly insulated environment didn't dry, it would get trapped in the insulation. So we've realized that we have to control all the air that comes into a house because that air contains moisture most of the year. So modern homes are very airtight. We try to eliminate any potential for air to come in um, except where we want it to, which is through a mechanical ventilation system, through the use of either an ERV or HRV, energy recovery ventilator, heat recovery ventilator, that manages and controls the air exchange in your home. These drastically improve air quality and eliminate any chance of moisture buildup in your wall cavities. So on this project, we're using an exterior air barrier. And so this house wrap is what's serving as our air barrier. So it is fully taped and joined. It starts at the bottom here with a strip that is installed between the foundation and the sill plate. That is caulked to it, so the concrete is naturally airtight. Then we have this Tyvek strip that comes up behind here. This gets put over top with a band of tape, so that is now airtight. And then it continues all the way up. Every joint is taped to manage the same thing. It's connected to the windows through the inside window prep and seat rod and caulk sealant. And then it goes up to the top and transitions to the inside of the home through a strip up there. You'll also notice that wherever we have penetrations, we have a little EPDM boot here that makes sure there's no air that can leak between these wires into the wall cavity. And by doing all this, we virtually eliminate any air leakage into the house, and we'll test that before we cover this all up with a blower door, which is where we put the house under vacuum and um, test for air leakage. 